marijuana. Day 457 of coronavirus quarantine. That's what it feels like anyways. I'm really making this video just to get more personal with you guys to try and help you guys and myself stay busy keep uh, keep mentally strong as well as worrying about not going places and not doing as much as you would normally be doing make sure you're keeping yourself mentally strong also keep your mind busy the littlest things will, will help I mean I've, I've been doing a little dot to dot um, art here I had one This. this was my first one turned out to be an elephant hmm, who knew I could tell by the dots but hey kept me busy I also did another one so yeah just just keep busy keep keep your mind active keep doing things I know a lot of my keeping myself busy lately has been helping the my two daughters that are actually in school with their online classes making sure that's organized handed in I have to I have to get a little bit better at staying on top of when things are due because I'm the one that keeps the handing in organized as long as they do the work I don't mind helping them out handing it in and getting their their grades as they should be but yeah keep yourself busy keep your little ones busy stay home stay sane it's not always easy try and stay happy do things that make you happy, that will occupy your mind. Not, uh, I know sometimes we, we do enjoy some downtime, watching our favorite shows or movies. But also try and keep your mind busy. Do things that will create brain work, if you know what I mean. Do things that will create usage of your mind. Make sure your mind stays busy during these times. That is, that is a big part of this. It's a really big test on all of us for our mental states. Keep doing things that you enjoy. I know lately we've had, we've even had bake-offs here. We've had, uh, get, we got the whole family involved. We had, uh, I think eight households were all involved in a little bake-off while practicing social distancing, of course. Hands down, I want to put that out there. In each of our houses, we did uh, some desserts. And then one family member went around and picked up the, the desserts that were left in packages on doorsteps. So we didn't have to communicate or discuss anything with anybody. And then uh, once all the packages were picked up, we divvied them up and make sure everybody got a piece of everybody else's. And then once everybody got theirs, we everyone brought them home, had taste tested all the desserts. And then we went online and uh, voted for who had the best dessert and uh, it turned out my uh, my eldest uh, daughter and my wife won the won the championship the first um, of I think more to come everybody enjoyed doing it with us and uh, it kept us all busy having fun and interactive with with our family members while practicing this social distancing and we all got to try some tasty treats so Everybody won. It was a lot of fun. It brought everyone together while being apart. I think that was the, the main focus of this whole bake-off competition. So yeah, that's how we've been holding it down. Just keeping everyone busy, keeping everyone talking to each other. It's been a lot of fun. While doing my fishing videos, it has been a lot of fun and keep kept me busy during this time. I also have made time for my family, myself, with doing my little dot-to-dot -dot art here. Doing some online shopping through Amazon. <laughs> Cost me a little bit of money, but... I think but those those lures will definitely be put to use and we'll get some videos out to you guys when the time comes and we'll be able to actually uh, get them in the water so I just wanted to touch base with everybody get get right personal with all of you and make sure everyone is staying safe staying sane I think is is the best way to put it because it, it's not easy it's not easy it's not been easy for me it's not been easy for my family but this is something that we have to do and when the time is right it'll all change and we'll all be able to see everyone we want to see and go the places we want to go so that's all i got for you guys today stay safe stay sane minden hills fishing i'm paul carwana you know where to find me minden hills fishing we're on facebook 
we're on Instagram, we're on Twitter, so yeah, I'm always having fishing tips on there, I try to do one daily, doesn't always happen, I get at least, at least three or four out a week, guaranteed, yeah, so check me out, check us out, I always post the links to the new videos on Twitter, always have tips, always have tips for fishing, so that's all I got for you, man, that's all, happy fishing, can't do that, happy homing, and that's what we're doing these days, stay home, stay safe, Minden Hills Fishing, I'm Paul Caruana. Cheers.